reaching out. Amen. His blood oh. is his surgeon. There's nobody greater than Jesus. Yeah, nobody. Nobody greater. You know, I, I, as she was saying, I thought about something Peter said. Peter says, silver and gold. Have I not? But such as I have, I give them to you. That's the word of God. Glory to God. Glory, glory. And I'm saying to you, keep coming. Because like I said, God is waiting. God is always waiting for us. Yes, yes. And, and let me tell you something. I can let you down. Your parents can let you down. Yes. Your friends can let you down. My Lord. Yes. My Lord. But you see Jesus? He will never, ever, ever let you down. When he, when he said he got your back, he got your back. Believe what I'm telling you. He got your back. Yeah. I want you to understand that. And let me tell you something. They got they got three preachers up here right now. Glory to God. Glory to God. They got three saved. These men are saved. Glory to God. And let me tell you, if you ready. They ready? Oh, I can only see. I can that's all I can offer you. Yeah. And I, 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 I can see something about your eyes. Yeah. Yeah. You know. And I'm gonna leave that talk with you. My Lord. Because when you're ready, they're ready. They're ready to receive you. And let me tell you something. The only separation. You and God, it's just a simple walk. A walk down the altar. If you if you make one move, and I'm not begging, I'm just explaining. I'm just trying, I'm trying to tell you how it is. If, if you if you just just move, these fellas are gonna jump. My Lord. My dad is 70 something years old, 76 I think, and he gonna jump. Ella Coleman gonna jump. My Lord. Ella Solomon gonna jump because that's their job. Yeah. Church gonna be jumped. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Hallelujah. I'm gonna leave that thought with you because you see, I hate to say, you know, you you you, you don't scare people, and I'm not I'm not ever gonna call a scare but I was lucky. I was blessed. I mean, I was blessed. I'm correct, but I was blessed. 48 years, I stayed out there. I did what I wanted to do. I got a lot of people in the graveyard that didn't live to see 48 years old. You see, you see the, the, the tomorrow is not promised. And you see, when people talk to you like that, then, you don't know what the future holds. God put you on my mind for a reason. You came three nights for a reason. Yeah. My Lord, my Lord. God could be saving you for something. That's right. Amen. Amen. See, a lot of times we get in trouble, or we get we get in trouble because we don't understand. Yeah. But but God saves us from something. He keeps us out of predicaments. Yeah. They had a young man was here a couple weeks ago. Said on one of these funerals. And somebody put a gun to the back of his head and blew his brains out. Sure you know, you know what? Sure That's a plea God can always make to you. Yeah. You know, tomorrow is never promised. Glory and I didn't mean to say all that, but I like your spirit. And I like your attitude. Yeah. And that's why I told you that God put it on my heart to share that with you tonight. Thank you, Jesus. Tomorrow is not promised. 